the important thing. You know, we really love those guys, and that was really our motivation for this game. And uh, definitely, you know, really wanted to get to a bowl game. So those two things really played in the factor of uh, our effort and, and the energy we came with. How big was the ending to last week for this game? How easy that made you guys? Um, the ending really didn't affect us. Uh, there was a lot of mistakes early in the game as far as red zones and uh, different things that factored into the loss. So I'm, the ending of the game really shouldn't have happened because we kind of didn't do what we needed to do early on in the game. Encouraging you were able to close this one out the way you were then, considering what happened last week. Huh? Encouraging that you were able to close this one out and you know, not have it be closed for most of the fourth quarter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, definitely, you know, definitely came out... Uh, Definitely came out with a lot of energy, a lot of intensity, and uh, the team really came to play. And uh, we got on them early and, uh, you know, came in back at halftime and didn't really want to look back. What was the deal with the energy? You know, you know talked to Travis a little bit about you guys just coming out and starting a little slow, but you guys were hooping and hollering, you know, before the game started doing all the dancing. Tell us a little bit about that. Um, you know, it's just a, it's, it's like a vibe you feel, you know, it's kind of contagious, you know, when you see one guy do it, the other guy do it, and all of a sudden, you know, a butterfly effect happens, you know, everybody gets a lot of energy and everybody starts to wake up and then, you know, that's where you get the pump up all through the field, trying to get the crowd into it, our old 12th man thing, and, you know, try to get it going. What have you seen from Dwayne Washington running behind him? Obviously, he's had two good games back to back now. What have you seen from Dwayne in the past two What have days? I seen from Dwayne? Mm -hmm. I've seen a competitor in Dwayne and a guy that really runs hard. Uh, very downhill, one cut decision, gets upfield, you know what I mean? And Dwayne's speed is, is, is crazy. Okay, Dwayne gets into the open field, and I mean, you know, he, he takes off, and you know, that's it. If there's no one in it, really close to him, Dwayne has the speed to take off. And running behind him only makes me want to go harder because, you know, it's, it's, it's still a competition at all times, but at the same time, you're still cheering him on. What's this last month or so been like for you, just first getting hurt at Oregon and trying to shake that off and, and not getting as many carries and now finally kind of getting back into things? Um, you know, it was just a it was a grind, but at the same time, you know, you're happy to see the rest of your running backs, they can stay up and, and keep it moving without you, you know what I mean? And uh, it felt really good to see Cooper and, and Dwayne, you know, and Shaq, all three of those guys really come out and produce, you know, everything that we needed at the time and then slowly working my way back in, you know, I just, when I got the chance and the opportunity, you know, I made the best of it and, uh, you know, really thank the offensive line, those dudes, no matter who's in at the running back, they still do their job up front. You feeling good back to 100% and all that now? Or? Yeah, I feel really good.